Guard Post and Searchlight Script. What's up everybody, this is Gunter Servalo. Today I'm going to share with you two scripts that I use in my missions and I'm going to show you how to install and set them up in the editor. Let's go to the editor, we're going to go to Stratus and then we're going to load up a mission that I've set up for this demonstration. We're going to place down a few assets so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to need a player. So we're just going to place down a rifleman. And that's all we need to do with him. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to go to the airfield over here by the road. And we're going to place down a car. And this is going to be a Hunter HMG. I'm going to face this guy this way. And then we're going to give this guy some waypoints. We're going to go to the 2D map and we're going to go to waypoints and then to move. So we want this guy to move. This guy is just basically going to control the area. And then cycle it. This last waypoint is going to be cycle. All right, that's it for that. Next is we're going to place down a boat. So we're gonna go back to NATO. Go to boats. We're gonna set up a speedboat in this direction and then we're going to go to the 2d map click on them and then we're going to give them some move waypoints this guy is just basically going to patrol he's going to drive way over here waypoint he's going to the last waypoint he's going to cycle just like the uh, the truck all right so that takes care of him next we're gonna go to over here actually we're gonna go to this tower I'm gonna go to the tower and set up a, a turret raised Doesn't matter, really matter which direction this guy's gonna face, but I'm actually gonna do something, something different that you normally wouldn't do in a tower. I'm gonna put this guy in the top. So he's gonna be right here, and you'll you'll see why once we get started. All right, so that's all we're gonna place. So there's two scripts I'm gonna show you. There's a searchlight and then there's a guard post. I'm gonna show you the searchlight first. We're gonna to go to the script and take a look at the script. And I'm gonna show you how to install it and implement it. So let's go take a look. Okay, we are in the folder of the mission and the mission is called guard post and searchlight script. That's Stratus. So in the mission, we have the mission SQM, which is the mission itself. And then we have the searchlight script and a folder that says scripts. This script right here is an I and I script for the searchlight. And basically this is where you could use some different uh, settings, some different codes. I'll show you that in a second. And in this folder, you have a couple of scripts. One for the searchlight is this script. So when you install this script into your own mission, all you need is this script. You could use a scripts folder if you want, but the code that you use to call the script in the mission has to basically have the, the name of the folder that you use the code. We have the, this script and we have the script here. The script I'll show you after. 
So that's basically how you install it, those two scripts. Now to call it into the mission, we're gonna go to the INI script here. Now this script was created by Elias. You could see a tutorial actually on the script, how it works and stuff that uh, he put together. You could do a couple of things. If you run the script from an init.sqf or another script use, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna name the vehicle and then you're gonna basically put this code into the vehicle's INIT box. Just remember, you name your vehicle and then you put the name of that vehicle into this box and replace the vehicle name here. Normally, what I do is I just use this code here. So we're gonna copy that and then we're gonna go back into the mission. I'm gonna go to the, where the truck is. All you have to do is click on the truck itself and add code to the vehicle's INIT box. That's all you have to do, just control V to paste the code and then press OK. It looks like it doesn't have any spotlight, but you won't see it until you get in game. Let's uh, go to the boat. And that's set. Our turret, machine gunner. Paste the code in the gun for him. Change the time of day to 1800 hours. Okay, it's gonna be dark, so light enough to be able to see. So we're gonna save that and we're gonna test that out. He has a spotlight on him. Let's go to the boat. Move the grid zero two seven zero six zero. He has a spotlight mounted under the gun. And that's what this script does. So the spotlight is pretty useless in in some respects until the guy turns around and looks at something which it will work now if you want to make this more interesting that's where the guard post script will come in we are back in the mission folder we're gonna grab the guard post script so it'll be in the scripts folder and this is the script here guard post.sqf open that up so this script is called Simple Guard Post Script, and it's by Tofi of Astagota Ops. I think that's how you say it. So you have a basic usage, which is this, this code here. Optional settings let you tweak uh, other, other various things. For example, you have a unit, the range in degrees, which is whether the guy turns 180 degrees or 90 degrees or 360 degrees uh, his behavior his stance so the stance could be up down middle auto auto is you know based on what you put them in look up look down minimum delay we're going to use this code here you're just going to highlight it and then you're going to hold down control and then press c and that'll copy it to your computer's clipboard when you go to the vehicle what you got to do is you got to find the gunner of the vehicle so in this case it's going to be this guy with the cross here and then you're going to go into his INIT box and press control V and add the code now something I want to point out is if your guard post script and this goes for the searchlight script too is in a scripts folder or another folder is you're gonna have to add the name of that folder so that when the script is called that the the game knows where to locate the script we're gonna put scripts and then backslash into the code itself so the backslash represents a folder 
the game's going to look for the guard post script in the scripts folder and that's how that works so once you have that just press ok and you're all set there and next we're going to go to the boat and same thing for this what you're going to do is you're going to go to the you have to look at the boat for this one because the spotlight is in this gun here which is the commander seat this one is the rear gunner which doesn't have a spotlight too so we have to go to the commander so you click on the commander press control b and then we're going to add scripts and then backslash so instead of doing having to do that again we're just going to copy that control c press ok and that sets up that the turn so we're going to put some light on this guy put the turn on the flashlight this one you're going to go to the gunner itself and then in his INIT box can press control V and then we'll have scripts backslash guard post in there as well just hit OK and that's it for that so now we could save this and check it out So you can see how useful this would be. It just makes the spotlight more functional. And this guy can look around with the spotlight. I'm going to show you a couple of clips of from two missions that I built. And you guys can see these scripts in action. A little clip from my mission, Drug Traffickers. ISIL foothold set on Kunduz, Afghanistan. So you can see the spotlight in action going through the house is kind of dumb so I could probably should have set this guy to 180 degrees but it works. We have more spotlights. zip this mission on Stratus up and put it on my Google Drive and you guys can download it and put the mission into the editor and implement the scripts into your own missions and uh, that's it. I want to thank you guys for watching and uh, I will catch you guys on the next video. Bye.